All right, let's go ahead and uh, check the mailbox here. It's another day, another day of adventures. All right, so there's jobs posted at the Pelipper office. So we're gonna head into town. There's uh, the strange purple Kecleon we, we'll, we'll never be able to get in the game. There's a Lombre, Snubble. Wait, do they have fairy types in this game? Because the original game had Makuhita Dojo. I don't remember that being a thing. Alright, so I remember there being like, uh... Oh yeah, Wish Cash Pond. So, uh, post-game you can evolve here. Because, uh, the wise and generous wish cash there. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and use our super speed here to get to the Pelipper office. This is the Pelipper post office. Basically think, uh, the male people from, uh, Animal Crossing. Bolton board, okay. So the more jobs we do, the more often than not we can end up going to uh, new places. The more jobs you solve, the more you can progress the story. So uh, our current job is in uh, Thunderwave Cave, and we have two jobs. So normally I would say, I'll oh, just go ahead and fight everyone. But uh, that's not the wisest decision uh, when it comes to doing missions. So when you do missions, you want to get out of there like relatively quickly because your hunger does go down. stats. So there's multiple places we could go here. And 
and I am still slowly getting used to these controls. Okay, so the item we're looking for is on the, uh... Alright, so a Reviver Seed pretty much fulfills the role of a, uh, Revive. So my travel speed has been lowered. Which is unfortunate. Stones and spikes are pretty much one-time use weapons. So this is the third floor where we have to find, uh... The ribbon. And the ribbon is up that way. And Charmander is just killing it today, folks. Still got things to do. So every every time time you enter a dungeon, you can in fact um, Okay, we leveled up. I am now level seven. Awesome. So the auto mode pretty much allows you to do things as quickly as possible. Ah uh, no, we, we are so close to finishing the dungeon we might as well just straight up uh... And, for whatever reason, I can't seem to, uh, turn here. So, we might as well just complete the dungeon. Okay, so that's uh, two jobs. We got two jobs done at one time. A fierce bandana and a perfect apple. There's Pelipper. Alright, let's see what we got. Check the mail. Welcome to the rescue team. Train at the M Makuhita Dojo. So let's go get more jobs from the uh, bulletin board. So I, you pretty much just have to keep doing jobs here until uh, you get something new. 
So we have three jobs. In the cave. So you, if you can get multiple jobs done at the same time, just go for it. Oh. Okay, so this allows us to just hop between the... The place. And where we previously were. Now then, we pretty much just have to guess where we're supposed to go. Which is kind of problematic because uh, we also have to escort our client with us. Aether. Alright, there is, uh... Give a Petra Berry. And there's a Petra Berry right next to it, so it's okay. So we still got more things to do here. So, Charmander is always going to be a bit behind me for the time being. So, Ember. Let's get rid of, uh... Let's get rid of Scratch. Always default into, uh. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. the uh, accepted other job here. Alright, so we have to get her to the next floor. a bit of damage there. Right, let's get some money and then we'll go uh, over here. Alright, this is the floor we need to be on. The controls for this game are just as clunky as I remember it being.
All right, let's escape from the dungeon. And that is three com three missions in like one level. So that brings me to five missions completed. We are really knocking these missions out of the park. Another night of sleep, and it's dream time. Trio. So we have been tasked to rescue Diglett from Skarmory. to rescue. Let's waddle our waddly legs and get over there. We have to make it through nine floors? Are you kidding me? Oh god, this is gonna be a nightmare. Nine floors of terror? Oh no. Dungeon shops. Uh, you want to stay away from these because Kecleon, doesn't matter what level you are, Kecleon will just automatically wreck you. Like, he is just designed just to just purely wreck your stuff. Kecleon is actually technically the strongest Pokemon in the game. Oh, oh, oh no. It's Beldum. Beldum's gonna be a problem. Alright, so it seems I have gone in the complete wrong direction here. Somehow. Is, um... Uh... Oh, are you kidding me? 
Well, uh, let's grab the money and go. <laughs> like, I need to preserve my, uh... Oh, my water gun was upgraded. Okay. So moves become upgraded if you use them for an extended amount of time, which is kind of nice. And whoa there, buddy. Uh, can't be having that posted in my chat. Ban. another shop over there. So basically one of the easiest way to figure out where you're supposed to go is to just look at uh, like oh hey where is the need to start conserving uh, move usage because uh, if I don't I'm not gonna make it through uh, this dungeon So we finally found- okay, so the- I finally figured out how to switch between people. So let's, uh, feed myself an apple. Because I am pretty much starving. The fourth floor. damage, so we're gonna need to save that there. So we're gonna have to do a lot of switching between Charmander and Squirtle here. And now we're in the upper section of the dungeon, so things are gonna get a lot harder from here. Because if I remember correctly, if the terrain changes pretty significantly, um, basically it means like, oh hey, uh, you're gonna have to really watch things. And do I have like any, uh, aethers? Oh yeah, I'm gonna need those if I'm gonna be encountering a ton of Geodude. 
Alright, we'll check this area over here. Took a lot of damage there. An uncomfortable amount of damage, actually. Alright, let's uh, head on up through here. And let's see here, we got multiple things here. Multiple items. Uh, let's make sure to grab all the healing items we can. Seventh floor. Two more floors, and we have to face Skarmory. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, um. Let's go tackle. Oh dear god. Um Ember, let's go. Alright, so toolbox. Um, don't really. I I have two max aethers, so if I if I need them, I can go ahead and use them. But th this is the first real challenge we've had in the game so far. Okay, um, nope. Gosh darn it. Um, now I'm out of, like, water gun ammunition. Okay, so we finally found some stairs. So, we're over here. Let's go ahead and access our toolbox here. I will drink. And restore water gun. Now then, as for, uh... You, let's, uh, restore flame burst here. Flame burst is better than, uh... what we normally do. Okay. Oh no! The Diglett is over there! How are we ever gonna get him? Alright, we have no choice but to fight. Alright, 
Flame Burst is our best option here. How did I miss? There we go, we won. Oh hey, it's our friend Magnemite. Uh, Doug Rio. Oh, that's a problem. We don't have anywhere nearby. There's a Gardevoir. She's trying to talk to me. 